There's no, there's no smooching. None at all. No cooties. Examine. Skull. Try the key. It worked. The pedestal reveals That's a dark passage. And now we need only to send these treacherous steps into murky darkness. Ah. I mean, Baldur's Gate came first, as far as I know, Severed. So probably play that first. Let's descend these steps into murky, creepy darkness and probably get murdered. Are you guys into it? I'm into it. Let's do it. Horrible, creepy darkness. <laughs> Let's go. Definitely they'll be smooching in there. Mm. Nice and quiet. Hmm? What I'll have it in no time. The work of a moment. Oh. Lava. Is it dead? It died. Nice and quiet. What is this? Bunch of corpses? Huh? I'm not sure about this place. This place looks creepy as fuck. As you approach the blood pool, the viscous liquid churns and bubbles. You feel essence rising to the surface, reaching out to you, whispering. Someone should clean that up. Mm, who would create such a vile thing? Some strange power seems to be emanating, animating the blood. I'm going to hazard a guess and say that whatever it is, it isn't benevolent. Grotesque masks and pools of blood? They aren't half-hearted in their madness, are they? A place of death. We should not linger here. I'm gonna fucking extend my soul to the blood pool, 100%. There's no way I cannot extend my soul to the blood pool. I have to check out this pool of blood and horribleness the faint whispers resolved into a cacophony of voices you imagine yourself surrounded by a hundred men and women their naked flesh is scourged and bloody or skinned and covered with flies their eyes are missing replaced by glittering black stones the voices cry out in unison what's this Another soul come to rage and burn, or merely to watch. You may be a long time in waiting. Our work today is already finished. You were all sacrificed to Scan, weren't you? We were sacrificed to the whims and hungers of the rich and powerful. But what we gave here, that was our decision. They hover at your soul's edge, feeling you out. Our fury burned within us, unquenched and unfed. But hate can be fashioned into a weapon by those willing to pay the price. In life we were weak, but in death we made a choice. Choice carries power. Um, what kind of power? If you must ask, then you have never had need of revenge. It is a shame there is nothing in you we could use. Hold. I would know what you've done here. The pool itself begins to ripple with the sound of a dissonant chorus of perverse laughter that rakes at your ears. The lapping blood stirs a large metal cage half submerged in the center of the pool and it creaks loudly as it rocks back and forth on a rusted pulley, as if in answer to your question. Wait, let me ask you more questions. That was it? Can I ask him more questions? Ah, fuck. I can't ask more questions about the blood pool, you guys. Why? I just want to ask questions about the blood pool. What's so I wrong with that? A calm sea, which is not very. 
What's so wrong with asking questions about a pool of blood? Okay. I want to make friends with the blood pool. Oh, God damn it, Ayla. God damn it, Aloth. I fucking hate you. Oh, God. Everyone get in here. Not just Aloth. Aloth, go over here. Everyone else. Go over here. Aloth, go over here. Why is everyone trapped in the door? Get the fuck over there. Except for you, Aloth. There we go. Maybe some questions should be left unanswered. No! But pools of blood. It was so creepy and great. I'll see what I can find. Of course. No, I forgot. Loot the bodies. If you're just playing Vampire the Masquerade, I've taught you anything. It's that blood pools make the best of friends. What you oh, Jesus. Thing is? Gotta go a little slower, I guess. Let's see what lies this way. Mother of God. Aloth, get in Fine. front. You're worse than Aloth. What? Did you just say I was worse than Aloth? I, you are, like, fucking. You might find this interesting. Worse than Aloth? Oh, I can't disarm that trap. Well, everyone's gonna die. Oh yeah, Isselmir is badass. I love her accent too. Be cautious. Be constant. I'll have it in no time. The work of a moment. Oh my god, do I get another blood pool? Damn it, there's no pool of blood in here. Need heavy armor on mother if you keep her melee? I will. I'll change that up. Okay. A large bull-necked man in a hood helps a young elven woman down from a glass chamber connected to a diz dizzying array of cables and machinery. Her skin and clothing glisten with fresh blood. Oh, I certainly hope that this is the girl we were looking for. <laughs> you may feel a little lightheaded for the next hour or two, but that will pass. Have a meal and get some sleep when you return to town. Is that Matt again? The transfusion. This is Matt. That's Matt. So we've got three Matts in the room with us right now. That's 100% Matt. <laughs> yep, that's Alice. The transfusion will be smoothest if you relax and rest. The implanted essence already has a hold on your mind. So fighting it will be useless. And I hope our new visitor does not complicate matters overly. Is it evil Matt? I'm super hype. Evil Matt. Subversion. The black sheep cousin of justice. Or haven't you heard Lord Heron's tale of woe about a missing daughter and an impending marriage? He's sent his soldiers to scour the village while he bides his time at the Dracogen Inn. I don't expect you to understand what I'm doing. Evil Neither the Matt. rituals of Scan nor the labors of Animancy meet with much approval in polite society. But unsightliness reminds polite society that there are limits when no one pays attention to the excesses and debaucheries of a lord you give them something they can't look away from um heron said he was taking her to Ana's rest to find a suitor but a few pieces of his story didn't add up didn't they did a bit of digging did you that's more than can be said for most i'm smart okay 
Lord Heron's been telling everyone she's his daughter. He brought her all the way out here just to avoid anyone who might know differently. She's his niece, and she's carrying his child. <laughs> Preying on a young woman, his own kin no less. Ah, you can't be serious. That's fucking horrible. It is the product of a corrupt and degenerate system of nobility. This is all to ensure that some drop of his blood, some mote of his essence, cleaves to his fortune long after he's dust in the ground. Heron's own wife's delivered nothing but hollowborn. Now, he's got no heir, and his sister's child, Elise, is reaching the age to marry. Without progeny of his own, Heron's legacy would pass to her issue. So, he found a way to continue his own noble line. By putting his child in this girl, his own niece. Ah. Uh... Uh, couldn't he have gotten a child by some other means than his niece? Not a highborn heir. Even if he disposed of his own wife by some means, what family would marry their fertile daughter off to him? Because he's a bastard. You can see the problem with this foolishness about blood and birth, I hope. Uh, and animancy is part of your plan to destroy him? Question mark. This isn't just about hair under the girl. It's about the corrupting influences of power and wealth. How people of privilege, people like Heron, are so often insulated from the consequences of their actions. The charged essence of dozens of maltreated slaves and underlings is already taking root in her mind. Once it's established, it'll drive her to murder her uncle, her aunt, and anyone foolish enough to get in her way. People won't be able to look away from Heron's sins then. The fuck? Seems like a lot of trouble to go to when a simple lynch mob will do. They don't get a lot of things right, but this kind of thing they know what to do with. I do not wish to destroy Nestor Heron. I wish to end his entire rotten line. His name will become a curse among strangers. The deeds of his house will be eclipsed by his ruin. Foes will hear his name and shudder with pity. And any relatives who should survive him will abandon their fortunes just to rid themselves of the association. Watcher, do not let this girl and her child become fodder for revenge. Let me touch her mind. I can free her from this snare, as well as from the memories that hold her cap captive. Yeah, fucking do it. Don't let her be all brain touched. The grieving mother bows her head. Thank you, Watcher. You feel her reach out, persistent yet gentle. Aelis does not move, but the grieving mother trembles with exertion, and the air around her rings with the sound of chimes. At last she collapses, her energy spent. The strain throbs in her mind. <gasps> For just a moment, Aelis's eyes close. When they open again, her expression is blank. But as she takes in the scene before her, you, Wymond, and the machinery in this strange, dark room, her confusion turns to fear. She lets out a choked cry. Kill them. All of them. If she can't destroy Heron, then we can destroy his legacy with her. No! I can't let you kill that girl. Will she die? I just, I don't. Um. Can I? What is this? Oh. 
Okay. Where's the girl? Is she already dead or... No, she's over here. Okay, she just gets out of the way. All right. I was like, is she already dead? Did she already die? Because that makes me upset that she would be dead. Okay. Can you... What do you got here? Oh god, um... Come on. Uh, where's that motherfucker? Did we take him down? I think we already took him down. Okay. Pew, pew, pew. Hi, big fat walrus. How are you? Okay, I'm glad that she, like, gets out of the way. Are we done? We did it! Okay, so our scepter leveled up. Um, so we can either deal 300 damage to dazed enemies or 1,500 just any kind of enemies. Cool. Rad. Awesome. Stay away. I don't know what happened here. Uh, Scanite cultist kidnapped you? But what? Ah! Hylia's wings. I can hardly remember a thing. She murmurs something in a dialect of Rao Tai, then Valian. Banome. No, my name is Aelis. A liar. The opening notes of the false knight. I... Uh. Um, you are a young noblewoman who was taken advantage of by unscrupulous relatives. I also know I can't go back to the village, though I don't remember why. And I certainly can't stay here. Um, there's a temple on the edge of town. I'm sure the clergy will help you find someplace safe. Ugh, it's good advice. I won't look back. Poor girl. Okay, so we have to look and see if we have any heavy armor to put on our lovely lady there. Uh, unique heavy armor. Uh, deflection against range attacks plus move speed plus recovery speed. I mean, sure. It's a thing. You can wear that. For right now. It'll do. Because she's melee. I'm having her as melee. I don't know why, but she is. Watching you at dialysis? Oh, well, I'm glad that I can help you dist get distract you from something that sounds fairly shitty. It must have been the other one that was really hard. Ooh, a dagger. What's this dagger I just got? One-handed slash damage fast, accurate, exceptional predatory. I might want to give this to her. What do we got? What's the difference here? Um, plus a lot of accuracy. Um, the interrupt is weak, but the speed is a lot faster. 20% of Greg's is converted to hits, though. 
10% of hits converted to crits. Uh, I feel like this one is better. But 30% damage versus 20% damage. I think this is the adjusted, though. Bye, Saint Guard! Dual wield? Oh, shit, I can. I can just dual wield. Oh, fuck yeah. Fucking both of them. Why not both? Question mark. I brought they're both one-handed weapons. All right, what's over here? Do I have... I mean, there's hella other places to go. So let's just continue, I suppose. I just quick saved. I shall be quiet as a calm sea. I'll have it in no time. The work of a moment. Are you talking about the first um, divinity, a big fat walrus? Because I haven't played the first one. I played the second one and I really, really enjoyed it. But this game was made so long ago that I think like it was in 2015 versus um, divinity just came out last year. So, um, I feel like comparing in terms of like a lot of graphics and stuff is kind of like, Ing. um, I'm looking, it's also, it's also, a, a, I mean, the graphics are pretty comparable. I would say the story in this one is a little bit harder to follow than the story in Divinity 2. I don't know about Divinity 1. Um, and the combat in this is real time versus the combat in Divinity, um, is like turn-based. So you get your turn, and then your next player gets your, their turn, and then the enemies get their turn. So um, that depends really on what you prefer in terms of combat. Like, I found it very hard to adjust to the real-time um, AI-type combat. Um, because I'm more used to, like, getting to pick each individual time what I'm doing. But it does speed things up. Okay. <clears throat> you wear a call of your own, Watcher. I see you shrouded by old lives and unanswered questions. Um, yes, I've felt them more and more of late. This is why we journey together, that one may draw strength from many, and that much may be mended by the purpose of one. Your obscure past, does it trouble you? Uh, yeah. I don't know what's in there, and that troubles me. Take care, Watcher. Do not let the unknown chapters of your soul thwart your present endeavors. You must fortify your mind and find clarity in your purpose. And she just fucking pieces out. But now she can level up. Oh man, her stealth is so good. Uh, I guess stealth is her stat? Um, I don't really tend to send people off on their own that often, but what the fuck, I'll just put it in stealth, I don't even know. Body attunement, the cipher probes the mind and soul of the enemy target, finding the strengths of its defenses and stealing them for his or her own, drains a portion of the target's damage reduction. Whoa, that's rad! Mind Lance inflicts pierce damage to anyone in a line of attack. Um, that's target with area of effect. I don't know if I want to do that because it might hit us. 
Uh, latches on to some characteristic of the target psyche and drains it, granting the same as a bonus to the cipher. Affects a random attribute. Body attunement seems like the way to go. I'm gonna do body attunement. Psychic back backlash invokes a retaliatory strike, stunning an enemy whenever they target the cipher's will defense. And then they're stunned. I mean, I like that because they just try and hit me and I'm like, fuck no. Um, two weapon style, two 20% dual wield attack speed. That's pretty good. Bloody slaughter is great. Um, mental fortress. Not really. Um, I think I'm going to go with the psychic backlash. I like doing the class specific talents. Good night, Zillowis. Have a good one. Um, okay. Uh, let's, let's continue. Eyes open. Continue forward. Manic sir. Welcome back. Thank you so much for the continued support. I really appreciate it. That's really good versus vampires. I bet it will be. Because anyone that... Or other ciphers, probably. Anyone that does, like, mental damages. So I don't want to exit yet. I don't think that... There's still more to explore down here in these ruins. You resubbed a couple days ago? Ah, Twitch is weird sometimes. Hi, bees. How are you? Yeah, I do like when you have cool-looking characters. That's for sure. You got done with a D&D &D session where half the party ended up in jail? Oh, no. Oh, no. Well, I hope you have a plan to get out of there. Ooh, there's another place over here. Temple Fanatic. Hey, what's up? Ha, get wrecked, Fanatic. this person is there more I want to fight more people no not yet oh to the flock. Aww, peppermint thank you so much for that twitch prime sub welcome and enjoy your month of free emotes courtesy of twitch prime ah oh, mother of god Aloth, you fucking should know better you are our trap guy. What the fuck, Aloth? Can we throw up some love and hype for Peppermint for that new sub? That means we are one step closer to that emote. Oh man, I really want it. I don't know what to do, but I really want it. Um, I should put Aloth back. Hope you're not expecting much. Hey guys. Oh god. A trap. Perfect. A left down drink. Seriously. God damn it, everyone, just get into the fucking room. Oh god. Get in this room then. Everyone disengage. There we go. Wait, who's this? That's me? Oh, wolf out. Can't stop doing that. I'm gonna die. It's fine, I'll just die. I'll take it. It's my fault. Okay. I 
Dr. Fight, can you open the character sheet and show me times Aloff has been down? Oh yeah, I didn't know you could do that, but I can totally do that. I would gladly. Oh, whoa, shit, I got up. Oh god. No, I don't need to do that. Right. I forgot I got res now. Get wrecked. Fucking right. Okay, so open character sheets, Aloth. So what do you want to see? Personal. Um, time's knocked out 26. <laughs> okay, and let's look at everyone else in the party. ear has been knocked out six times. She's been knocked out three. I've been knocked out eight. Kana's been knocked out four. And she just got to the party. She hasn't been knocked out ever. 26. 26 times. Mother of God. Jeez Louise. Aloth, please. Aloth, please. <laughs> All right. Anyway. Keep an eye out. Oh, hey, look. Breathe. Well, that was too easy. Oh no! Did I just hit myself? I didn't mean to do that. I just wanted to collect these items. Not a sound. Fire him. You're fired. I can't. He's voiced by Matt Mercer. We've already said that we're in this game to collect all the mats, so what kind of person would I be if I didn't collect all the mats? What do you suppose that bally thing is? What do you suppose that bally thing is? What's this? Two posts stand firmly in the stonework with broken ropes falling into the dark chasm of a large cavern. On the other side, there's a slight opening of where a bridge may have led. The darkness below continues as far as you can see. The broken stone pillars, the remnants of the missing bridge, rise from the abyss. Across the gap, you can see the mouth of a tunnel. Wooden beams protrude from the stones on either side of the chasm. Despite their age, they look sturdy enough to hold a grappling hook and rope. Two posts stand firmly in the stonework. The other side, there's... Okay, um, so I could toss my grappling hook, but let's, like, take a look at what's over here first, I think. And then we'll do grappling hook stuff. Oh, man, I might need to rest, too. Let me change her back to ranged. Oh, right. He charmed that guy. That was confusing. I was like, we're done. And then I was like, wait, no, we're not done. Because he's been charmed. That's charming. Is this the place we were before? Yeah, I don't think that's willing to talk to us. It won't talk to us anymore. The blood pool won't talk. Good night, ducks. Glad I could help distract you when you're getting dialysis. Is there anyone else? Doesn't look like it. 
Okay, well, we got another firewood. Oh, there's enemies in sight? Oh, over here. Yeah, the herd dual wielding is fairly slow. I might want to up the speed of the dual wielding. I'll see what I can find. What's this? Skulls lashed onto an is. effigy. Oh, mother of pearl. Okay. Oh, god damn it. Just don't go ahead of the rest of the group. Oh, god. Stop going ahead of the group. Just trigger every fucking trap. Just no. trigger all of them. Just trigger every trap. Just fucking just do it. I don't even care. No. Okay, there we go again. Fuck! Why did she die? What fucking happened? Ah, oh, mother of pearl. It was like ten minutes ago. Damn it! I should have saved. It's fine. We'll whip, whip through this place. No problems. Hair flip. Oh, I didn't save after I leveled her. Ah! Ah! Okay. Now let's do this again. Stealth. Body attunement and psychic backlash. Okay. Alrighty. So now I have to do all this bullshit again. Okay. Keep an eye out. This time with saves. Don't let me forget to save. Hi, Panda Koala. How are you? Hi, Hippophant. Combat auto slow is a really useful option, too. Combat time. Auto pause at a fixed interval? That's not what I want. Auto slow. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Remember to save. Remember to save. Remember to save. Oh, right. And I wanted to... Oh, I forgot to rest again, didn't I? Did I change her armor? I probably didn't. No, she's wearing her heavy armor. Okay. Is she dual wielding? Something's wrong with me. Something's wrong with who? She is dual wielding. Okay. I have them. My mind. Ah, so dark. Did someone get poisoned or something? Was that what the something? Okay, so now it feels like it's really slow. I guess I could put it on faster. Did some? Did you do your own art or did someone else do it? Uh, I'm not an artist. I hired someone to make the, all the art for me. Um... So uh, none of the art is my work. Um, several different artists I'll have I can do. Uh, helped to the create the art for this channel. Yeah, Rose knows what's up. And then we have new merch shirts. Um, we already did this. We have new merch shirts that were done by uh, Separating, see what lies this um, which are really rad on uh, the exclamation mark DBH. Um, oh, custom formations. I didn't know that was a thing. Anyway. Slowly now.
And then our logo design. Don't want to go up there yet. Our logo design was done by uh, Charlie at In Gamerland, although I think she goes by something else now. Not sure what. Mm -hmm. Hope you're not expecting much. <laughs> Okay. We should be fine here. Oh, bye, DS. Have a good night. I don't think I like slow on. Here, let's open this door. Hey, bad guys. Why isn't everyone coming into the battle? Yeah, I do, Mwachi. I haven't used it super much, but um, I think that's, uh, I think we should. I think we should use it more often. Raise our friend from the dead. Yeah, get raised from the dead. Battles, you just sort of sit there and let the auto AI do stuff and let you set to do for them. You don't know what you're meant to be micromanaging. I think it's mostly in like harder battles where you might want to like take more care good night rose have a good sleep There we go. Dunzo, we did it. If you want to play in harder mode, you really need to micro everything. Yeah, so I don't like having to manage that much. So for me, playing in a mode where I don't have to like be the one in charge of everything or like take really a really long time to do like all sorts of decisions like that, it's... You should see this. Uh, no. Gorst. Uh, you hey. go trigger the trap. Ow. Keeping an eye out. Okay. You should see this. God damn it. Oh, it's just petrified them? Oh my god, they're just petrified. How did we not get petrified last time? Fucking no clue. We're not in combat. We're not in combat, you silly game. Made the skill save? Oh, I suppose. Oh shit, F5. Too late. Oh, I got it, I got it, I got it. That's not like Matt to you. Oh, 
Yeah, getting murdered, everybody. Okay. Slowly now. So many presents. Okay, I did save though, so this time we won't fuck everything up. God, that was such a long time to be not saved. So mad. That's unusual. Oh, right. There was still more over here that we hadn't done yet. There's so much to this dungeon area. Okay. Nothing over there. That's unusual. Just get all their shit. These cultists don't need this. These cultists don't need this stuff. It's mine. Okay. They're so weird looking. Whack him with a flail. Um, this isn't our earth. This is an alternate earth. Um, I think we're mostly basing on Celtic myth from the naming structures. Maybe Welsh? I think more Celtic. You played a priest of Scan as your character? We're disappointed when you found this area. Aww. I'm sorry. That sounds shitty. Are we good? Grappling hook. Perfect. I didn't realize you could play like a priest of scan. That's pretty neat. Okay, there's a room over here that I didn't go into. Let's go back there. You don't have to kill these guys. You can be friendly if you put on the robes and hood you found before. Ha <laughs> ha Rip. Oh. Oops. I haven't beat this game. No, I don't know how far I am. It's a long game. There's a lot of stuff to do. I have a lot of quests. You give up the loot, plus your character wasn't evil. I'm not evil either. That guy, he tried to like turn. He wanted to murder people, man. It wasn't cool. They're the bad guys though, so killing them is the way most people go. I mean, yeah, these, these people like, there's a that they they had like a ritual sacrifice where a bunch of uh, downtrodden like and enslaved women like just sacrificed themselves and then they implanted their memories into a young innocent noble gr girl's head so that she would murder her entire family. Oh, get out of there! Did you die? You died, didn't you? Or is she real dead? How dead is she? Okay. Can you do like a self peel? Do we have, oh, you don't really have a, mm. 
Is there like a... Um... Yeah, I don't know if we have a self-heal really. Okay, what's going on right now? Why aren't you fucking killing them? I don't... I don't understand. This game is one of your favorite soundtracks. It's really good. Your field triage heals real health? Okay. I need to save. Saved! If secrets whisper here, I shall listen for them. Another one. Okay. So now we've investigated that whole area. I think going back here. Poggy Rush, what? I'm sorry, do you have a problem with my gay ass? I think it's great. I have a really nice butt, actually. Actually. I shall be quiet as a calm sea, which is... Oh, more fanatics! <laughs> oh god, I'm watching. Oh no, I forgot I was really injured. Oh, rip everything. I forgot, little cat. Velma from Scooby-Doo? Oh, she's so cool. Wait, why is Kana out there? Wait, 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 wait. Everybody? Get the fuck out here. I have a problem, and my problem is that my fucking... Sword guys were at the back of the line. And now we're paralyzed, evidently. There we go. Pause. protection come on use them scrolls I forgot Bella from the walking dead I don't watch the walking dead I'm a weenie and I don't like scary movies leave it to me Oh, we did it! Yay! Now we're definitely going to rest. Cause holy heck am I like maimed as fuck right now. I understand. Now everyone come over here. Let's go to sleep. Let's go to sleep. Mm. There we go. Now we're all better. Stay in love. It's more of a high school I'll drama with no zombies. I can't. I'm just like, I'm a huge You're weenie and I just, I can't. Even a high school drama with zombies, I just, I can't. <laughs> Don't forget to save. Oh, thank you. You're so good to me. Okay, let me guess. This is the other side. Safe but exhausted. Love, 
Oh, that motherfucker. I don't want his cultist in my business. We've missed quite the bloody celebration, it seems. Jesus. Yeah. That is... Yeah. Look at my gun. I got a cool gun. Ugh, get wrecked. Ah. Safe but exhausted sounds like my memoir. <laughs> Freros. Freros. Wait, okay. I was like, why is this cultist? And then I forgot that Aloth's scepter does charm. It's really confusing. Oh, murdered. Chunks. Hard to hold on to. Just stop complaining, okay? I shall be quiet as a calm sea. Okay, so we've already been there. Not and very quiet. Real question, how are all these cults below such a small village and no one notices? It's supposed to be a secret cult. <laughs> I mean, it's really below the Deerwood, like, forested area. So it's not really, like, just below anything. It's definitely below specifically the forest. They shall see nothing while I see. Mm, yeah, another campfire. At least the enemies were nice enough to wait till your whole group was across to attack. That's true. It would have been so shitty if they're like, okay, half your group gets over there and the other half is dead in the chasm. Oh, Get back to town and half the village is missing. Oh, yeah, there might have been some. Oh. Hey, fella. Um. Hey, he triggered. Oh, no, he didn't. Alof still took the trap. God damn it. I was like, he triggered the trap for us. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Oh. I am the worst. And I know where this is now. I just remembered. Why did I just trigger all these traps when I remember that this is just goes right back to where I was? Mother of God. I am the absolute worst. I'll see what I can find. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot the traps. I'm just going to walk through all the traps. I wonder what this is. Aloth, you know what the fuck that is. God damn it. She's just like, ow. <laughs> oh, let's. I keep doing that. <laughs> I'm going to put these videos on YouTube and it's just going to be like, steam, 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 because I keep accidentally doing that. Okay, what about the other end of this hallway? Have I not been over here? Yay, more fighting! I don't like when the other guys say the same spells that I do. Wait, did we... Is there a cultist on our side? No, he's not on our side. Oh, yeah, the worm. If you change your party's formation, it makes it easier to get around some traps you might not be able to disarm. Yeah, I should, like, change them to being in a line and stuff. But I just... I forget. It's fine. I don't mind if people just pass out. We're only on normal mode here. People can just, like, pass the fuck out. It's fine. 
It, you're fine. You're not tired. <laughs> Shut up. Stop talking about being tired, okay? There's nothing in here except for some enemies. This guy's like, oh, I'm sleepy. And I'm like, stop it. Just stop it. Can't leave any cultists alive. They might rebuild. You know, I came into this area and I decided that all of these people were dying. Leave it to me. This is a dungeon, okay? Nice and quiet. All right. So I think I've discovered the whole cavern, in which case we just have to go back to here, right? Which means that we need to go back to here. Dungeon, town, same difference. You know, a town is just an underground, above ground dungeon. Guys, we are nine sub points away from 800 and getting ever, ever closer to a new emote. I know it seems pretty far off. But I'm excited. I want to get it. Dre! Welcome back for five months in a row. Town is just an underground, above ground dungeon. Some one of those things. Something that I say is true. I don't know. Sometimes I say things that are true and real. Ash na gimbaluk. Ash na Oh my god. Oh my god. I bet that guy was a cultist. Oh my god, he totally was a cultist! Ah! This whole time. 